I'm currently on top of a 700 capacity cruise. And today, we're going to find out if this small little drone can keep up with the speed of this cruise. Hey, hey, what's up? Uh, great video idea, but it didn't take off. So I wanted to test the speed of the DJI Mavic Mini. Can it keep up with a 700 passenger cruise ship's speed? You know, with the wind and with the waves, I thought, you know, it could basically equal out and they could travel the same speed. Or in fact, the drone can travel faster. I want to check that out, but I couldn't. This drone refuses to take off in its normal manner. When it takes off, it just flies off to the side and hits against the wall. You know what? We're not going to shoot this video anymore, are we? <sighs> so, anyways, I needed to check this out. So I went back home and I checked on my phone and there is indeed a firmware update. Now, after updating the firmware, you basically need to connect the phone into the drone and then it basically downloads from the software into a firmware. And now that I've got the new firmware, I have to check whether this drone is still functional or else I'm going to need to buy a new drone. So if you don't hit the subscribe button, I can't buy a new drone and I can't shoot videos like this for you guys. Now, seeing as though this drone basically can't fly up straight, it needs to go on some training wheels. Let's put on some training wheels. Training arms fully assembled. Alrighty, so this is after the firmware update. Basically, we're running on firmware version 1.00.0600 at 39.6 MB. First test flight. Wish me luck. Yes! We got it! It finally works! All you need is to update your firmware! I don't need to buy a drone, you don't have to subscribe anymore! <laughs>